Tree. He was exhibited uh, it, it's, um, uh, at, uh, at the, at the pedestal, like uh, it, it's uh, with uh, uh, balls. Yeah. This was uh, one of the good show, uh, Fulbright alumni show at the uh, Catherine Myers is a Oja gallery showing that work. It's my light, only only the light work show at I think uh, 10 light work shows shown at the gallery and, and the all the ambassador came and it was highly impressed with the, my light work and then uh, things. This was uh, Iran Biennale, is a collection of Wait, Iran Biennale. Shatadra, before you go to the Iran Biennale, can you go back to that slide one second, the Catherine Myers? Yeah. I just want you to talk a little bit about the Jali that you have created over here. You know, that is something which yeah. evolved in your work. Uh, you know, I I seen it in even in the show that I had with, with yeah, the yeah, yeah. Red Moon songs yeah. and how the Jali became part of your, uh, if you can tell yeah. a little bit about yeah. it. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Georgina. Uh, I was forgetting. Actually, uh, when I'm doing the research about Mughal, because Mughal is inspiring so much because, uh, and my schooling of Shantini Ketan, because we, we learn uh, miniature. And uh, I'm very much fascinated about Mughal cultures. And how, but the Mughal culture, how come in my, uh, like gender? So when, when I study, the when Mughal came, suddenly uh, they just uh, wrap up their female and they putting in a, like a jali. You can, you can see the, through the jali, you can see the outer world. I was uh, like surprised how, how the things. So here, the, my eyes was penetrating. Here is the, my penetration of my gender. So is a gaze was penetrating through the jali and your outer world. So it's called, it's also, because I also like to play my work with a double, double meaning. So here is a double meaning play of my work. And you can see that uh, half, half body was uh, uh, like a Shahjahan was lying down and the whole, the phallic, uh, and the pillars as uh, a, a Kutub Minar was uh, uh, another side and the flowers and all those things. So it, it could be uh, the Jali is, is uh, making a noise about the, the penetration, but it's not direct, but it's indirect because we, we are in, in, in a different country. We can we can be loud, so it, it's my sophisticated way. I I, I, I do that. Uh, I am not showing here the lot of Jali's work because I, I did lot of Jali work, and already uh, Georgina shows uh, one of the exhibition. So I uh, uh, just showing the light work. Okay, should I carry on? Yeah. So this is a collection of Iran Biennale. I was I was uh, happy to select it was I think 2016. My work was travel, and there is a sensor. I I play with a sensor uh, because uh, my study sensor and and a uh, lot of electronics. So when the people comes, the light are going to blow much, and when the people go, and the light down. And uh, it was uh, surprising that. Uh, in a airport, they say that what what is that inside that? Yeah, what you what you sending that? Then so I have to big the yeah, send them the big letters and um, blah blah blah. I, I have like I, I give the my passport copy, and uh, then they allow to exhibit. And the the, the curator was harassed uh, for the my work, but thank God after that they collected my work and uh, give the money. So it was give a big opportunity. So uh, again, that uh, the question coming that uh, the Iranian people say, they say that this is the Indian work. So all the time I have a question that Indian work or non-Indian work, but I, I, how, how come the, the light going to be up, the kind of uh, border of national or zones kind of analyze. So this is the question of myself also. Okay, a um, lot of time uh, my display, you can see that my display. So a lot of time my display was a little tricky. I use a lot of lights. This is a paperwork. I, it is uh, one of solo show, Debonier coin in Vietnam. In a residency, three months residency, I was there and then produced a lot of paperworks. So I, I thought that why the wall, why the wall? So I, 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 I the break the norm. So I was exhibiting uh, in the things and the people were surprised because uh, the Vietnam was a lot of foreigners and all. So it was surprisingly things. This is a Pune Biennale, first Biennale. 
Shubhat Kirkere saw my work and he was selected me uh, for the Pune Biennale. This was the first Biennale in Pune. And you can see that my representation, how the my animals, I was I produced the animals over there and things and, and the work also collected in Pune, one, one of the character. So, uh, so thank you, uh, my people who like my work. And, and this light is a very hegemony because when you saw the work and then you understand the power. Other, other than you can think that it's a digital or it, it, it's, it's no like uh, it's a copy paste kind of work, but uh, it's a very expensive and very much difficult work to produce that. So uh, that people like people love it and they collect it and they enjoy the whole, the pride. So that's why I, I, I'm talking about the pride. So now I'm coming about the uh, freedom of speech, a portal. So again, I'm talking few point. My image, my image is a techno realism, a pixel realism. My color palette, color palette is psychedelic and new media. Object, object is twin media behavior, art and performance and painting and lens based art. Why is new media art in my painting? Uh, because what is the new media? Because I, that I study in, in US. Uh, whenever you use any kind of equipment, any kind of technology, it's going to convert it to new media. And my, my work, multidisciplinary work is too many mediums, not only one medium. I, I can't work with a one medium. And uh, you can see the lot of performance is coming, coming now in my work. And all the times, the photography, all the time, uh, the things is a mixing, uh, overlapping with my work. In fact, the light, light with painting, uh, light with sound. So all the things is uh, coming up together. And uh, just a reference, uh, uh, the same thing. Uh, one of the um, uh, gallery owner in gender again, uh, she was uh, given the permission to paint uh, like graffiti to her uh, wall. So it was also a surprising project. I think uh, Georgina was right, the project, I, I think. is a realistic, but there is a technology involved with the generate the body. So, so uh, this is acrylic on canvas and you, you, can, you can read the titles. I, I know persons to read the titles and all that is my poem. So it's, it's all creation is my baby, uh, all creation is my child. So I, when I, when I first I write the poem and then I, then I think about the more of concept, then I produce that work. It's not a one minute job, which is uh, too much time taking. And uh, so here you can see the celebration of body, sensation of body. So uh, how, how the body is going to be celebrated uh, the, with a gesture. And I, you can see that I'm using a lot of insect because uh, few, like uh, we are so much techno savvy person. We are we living in the technological jungle. We forget about are surrounding us, there is a beautiful butterfly, but we forget, we, we ignore because there are no value, like a value less. So I feel that uh, I can give a value, value. And that's why I respect Jah the Akbar and Jahangir. You can see that Akbar and Jahangir was the first king who was, uh, uh, did the portrait of the, her all animals. And even they go to the the, their fight, they, they bring their artists and, and they, they uh, ask to uh, the, the, the do the illustration. So that's a very interesting thing. Okay, you can see that all insects is coming to my work. Again, the sandalias, all kind of nostalgic things. And sandalias is a story. Um, 300 years back, we came to uh, the city of Howrah. And we got the whole property from Nawab. And the funny thing, uh, uh, at the uh, end of the Nawab and the British came and they occupy our whole property. A huge mansion and all those things. We have become very poor because British says, no, all, all, all the land is our. So then we slowly, slowly start uh, another business. My grandfather, grandfather's fathers, 
then um, we, then we again we have to build up a very good mansion and suddenly uh, we, when we established our building and we established our business then the suddenly noxal came and they destroy our house and and um, kill our, our peoples in uh, surrounding us we have a big big forest we have a deer we have a peacock and they kills every everything so they, that's before my birth but I, I heard the story and I, I saw the pictures because my father is photographer and he documented every story so this haunting me that uh, the sandalier broken sandalier in my house so I was uh, thinking that in, in this is Taj Mahal inside Taj Mahal but I was thinking that my my sandalier because I think that my house was Taj Mahal so this is a story so this is again a Taj Mahal because Jali, because I already spoke about Jali, how the Jali is penetration and how the penetrating the eyes and the interplay intersects with the, our body and intersects our mind, or inter interaction with the, the passion. Yeah, it's a performance. The performance art is coming to my work directly. It's a collaboration of one one of the fellow artists is a. Is a building at Mexico. I, I inspiring the Mexico was very exciting to three months uh, traveling there and the three festival I was attend. Uh, so I was did the things. This is the paperwork uh, Taj Mahal story I, I told already. So you can see that uh, how the my Sajahan is sad and how the body and celebrating with the sensation and how the sensation going to undercurrent and under layered. So this is this is the things. The same same series. I was I was uh, doing that with the flowers and and the things. Yeah, same series. If you have any questions, um, you can ask. This is a new work. Uh, uh, I told that um, the work was changing uh, the COVID period because COVID period is not fast. Go fast. Uh, run fast. So you can see my work was a subtle change. Sorry, sorry. This second, this second, this second. This second. This second. I'll show you that. This second. Yeah. You can see the color. Color palette was changed, uh, and the uh, technique treatment. I was think uh, my, my thinking was revolving with the uh, ideas, but uh, the element I, I told that my element, my ego, passion, pride is there, but the whole notion was changing. You can see the the paperwork. You can see the paperwork now. Now I can show you the, my recent paperwork, so you can understand that my changes shift. So here is a huge space because everybody go to the home because the lockdown, you know, curfew. So the, where is the people? Because the road is empty, the sky is so clean, and the, and the, every every uh, tree was so green. Why? There's no smoke, no pollution. So I thought that I have to do that uh, things, and I used uh, my performance work. This is my performative body, and uh, again the insect and all, all those. I also things. wanted to bring up the point. Uh, can I can I just uh, interrupt for a minute? I just wanted to bring up the point of, you know, being uh, enclosed in your home uh, during the, the COVID pandemic time when we were in the lockdown, what that kind of feeling, you know, gives to the uh, artist when, when they are kind of that they are in a sense uh, trapped and, and, and uh, under lockdown. So there is a kind of a sense of also subtle frustration and uh, boredom and the whole idea of the passage of time you know i'm not sure whether you are going to show that slide but there was one performance which you did yeah I, I where have, you looked at the i had the slide yeah idea and the passage of time and, and the fact that you know we the daylight and the light outside has kind of gotten a very different significance because we are locked up inside uh, I think uh, you first need to speak of, about that later yeah. on when you but, uh, yeah. come to that slide if you are showing. Yeah, uh, I just first I say that uh, uh, 
I think the pa pandemic situation is a history. We ever see the history in our eyes. It's a beautiful time and the beautiful pathos. So it's a, uh, it's a diary. You can, you can acknowledge your diary pages. And also the frustration, you're talking about that. Very paranoid state because we are artists. We are free. We, are, we go to everywhere. We can step out the door. We can, we can go to the road. But when you the lock, lock yourself, like are you killing yourself, you're killing your heart, just murder yourself. So that's a paranoid situation. And I, I did that time a regularly performance event and regularly performance work to get out the first session. And that, that the, my, the event, uh, the last year, that mental health, how the artists get a mental health, they can watch the performance and they can talk to other artists because they're not going to society. They, they, they're cut, cut off the, in all the business. So how they pass their time. So he rearranged the two months, 70 international artists in my things. And we produce uh, this, this booklet of all peoples in my work all over the, uh, the country. So I think uh, Georgina said the right things, uh, the, the daylight and the, the light of inside uh, like a home. Anyway, light is light. How come is a light going to change the meaning? It's a journey of light also broader way, journey of inside and journey of outside. Light is a many meanings for me. So, um, you know, the Binod Bihari, the one work in our eye, actually the journey of eyes. So I feel the same thing with, with the work, the light. Light is broader way. And you know, Sanif, the word of Sanif, Sanif is my son's name. It's every church, uh, temples, masjid, every, everywhere is a small hole. The ray going to reach to the God. God going to Ram, Rahim, or, or Jesus, a, any kind of God in a, in a Buddhist temples also. So the light is very important. Light for life, light for tree, light for us. And like for sexuality, and like for passions, pride, ego, everything is a lie. But in a like lockdown time, I did one performance. How, 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 however, that solar solar system going to be locked locked down? What happened? The solar solar panels or solar system going to lock down? You are dark. You think that you you are in a the, the place that there is a six month uh, day, six month night. So that's, that's the, the, you can think that. And if, if your, your lockdown period going to be shorter and you, you're alive to feel that. So these are things, I, 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 later on I can show you the performance. Okay, so these the changes, you can, uh, uh, you can see that big, vast sky and a beautiful land. And uh, the, again, here is a space was very narrow because the, uh, the people are there, sexuality is there, dog are barking, and dog are very beautiful, and, and all gigis are flying around me, and it was uh, beautiful. And uh, when I was in Chicago, I loved the gigis. I, I, I was, uh, did a work with the gigis, and that's the affection with the gigis. And how the gigis are so lovely. And uh, so I, I was very uh, affected with them, and I, I use in my work. So. So this is the lock, like uh, after that, you can see that previous my drawing and you can, change, you can see that now changes. The white space, the building and the structure was only line. And I, I told that I love the miniatures and I, I jallies and all the, all the things and I use in my work. And here the shark, shark going to eat uh, uh, that uh, banana. So there's a mockery of the sexuality. And, and the pun to the sexuality. How come that, uh, that big shark is going to eat the banana? So, and as a golden and silver lines, you can see that the strong lines. I, and, and, and all the time people question me that you don't draw, you, you just uh, take a printout and, and you exhibit and all the time. I, I told, come on man, I, I, I did Shantini I and six, uh, the seven years my study and I, I have to do, and I did. So 
anyway, so this is my latest work. You can see that how my work was sifted and how it was encrypted with a, a, a new kind of gizmo. You can see that and all gold and silvers and again, the miniatures. Miniature is the, as much as gold, I feel very, very precious. The, the, so my next, I, I'm going to go to Iran to study uh, all the uh, mosaic and all those things to, I had an invitation, but uh, for the COVID I was, it was canceled because one of the co, co partners of Hexidexy Box is uh, Iran, Raha, Raha Art Foundation. So anyway, so, yeah. so this is the two last slide. You can see that the um, lizard and uh, the ant, um, or all the smokery happening with again the my mosaic and the all stories. Yeah. Okay. So this is the end of my painting, and I am coming to the performance art because because. Uh, why I uh, bring the performance art, you can see that how the, my, color, my painting palettes and the and LED palettes was changed with the light because I, I 24 hours playing with the light and I feel the, the performance art is not the, not a right term, it's a behavior art. Because uh, you know that uh, we, the, if a dinner table or lunch, lunch table or tea table, you can see that everybody sipping the tea was a different. So this is the this is the behavior. If we we present behavior art, that's a proper word because uh, all the time people are mingled up with the performance art and performing art. So I used to say that behavior art is a time-based art. It's a is a one time and improvising art is not a script, not a not kind of pre-planned. It's an instant. You have to act and you, you have to produce your intuition. So. Mm -hmm and a lot of negotiation of the space. There's a huge space, it's not a drama, theater. You, you cannot use a backdrop or uh, kind of things or space. You, you, you have a, a 360 degree angles. You can, you can go, you can, you can feel your viewers. So, yeah. so uh, this is uh, one of the festival in, in Vietnam. I was uh, doing work uh, uh, with, and all the time I used to work with uh, the peoples uh, in, in associate with me, and I, I, I take two of the fellow. Mm -hmm. So this is the one of the international festival in Nepal. I'm going to show the mainly the festivals work. This is the, the part of the Nepal festival. You can see the light, and you can see the light of daylight. That's a, uh, that Georgina just now talking about the daylight, and and the, and the when I uh, doing the night at the. Uh, I think Panoti uh, village is a, is, is a big, um, like a uh, huge mansion. I was, uh, and they say that no, our, our event is only morning because it's very cold. I told no, I, I, uh, forgive me. I, I just want to do that in a light uh, at the night. And it's a, you know, the, all the village people, they don't understand what's going on, but they, they surprisingly come and this photograph, uh, thankful to uh, do that one Chinese artist. He was part of our things, and he was so impressed to show that see that my my team work. HIV. I was most often work with the HIV. HIV is a made very important things because and and we we are so called very civilized, but we not have a knowledge about HIV. And I actually the first I produced in 2019, uh, Monihil Biennale. Before I read in September in Kolkata, uh, the colonial city, uh, so much civilized, one, pe one couples, they, they are HIV positive and they are the whole apartment, uh, like, sick, uh, like sick out for the, the apartment. Three days they are in, a, in the road. Then the human right organization give the shelter. So it's, it's shocking to me. Where is our education? Where is our, our civilization? How come to behave, behave like that? So then I keep working on that, that things and that kind of, it's not an awareness, but it, it could be the things that people can think about that, that aspects. Same event, it was a festival. I, I was invited in Mexico and I go there and, and I, I was represent my work. This is the same festival, but other place. 
I was collaborating with one uh, fellow. There, there the the rules. You cannot use any cloth. You can use the plastics, uh, your your costumes, and uh, and the then the again the light. The 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 collaborator was also the interesting with the light. So I was using the the lights, and I, we are interplaying with the things. Fog is very interesting object in my work uh, since. Um, uh, the first fog work I uh, did in uh, 2019, I was invited to set University Roto. I was the, give the workshop one month, uh, working with a student, and there is a film division. I was discovered the fog machine, and, and uh, considerably I'm using now the fog in, in my work. Fog also very sexually attracted, or you can uh, light also enrolled, uh, uh, making an atmosphere. This is a one, another festival from Germany. In a tree project, one hour we have to perform non-stop. So, and, and they recorded the performance. I was performing with the light again. You can see the tree. And this is also an, one of the festivals from the New York. I was invited in this year, 2020. You, you can see the inside the home uh, and outside the home, how, how the, my work was changed. But I am continuously using the light. Light is my periphery. Light is my main element. This is also one of the festival, New York. The so Mexico, another festival, I was invited. Uh, this is a very interesting point. From Iran, when the, the light labs, uh, Homer festival, they the only exhibit the light. They invite me that they say that, oh, I, 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 uh, we, we never seen your work, but we heard about you. So you have to do something, but with your clothing. No, don't do that without clothing. Even they, 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 sorry, just a minute. They don't allow to, they, they are censored to not to do a, like short pant. No, no, you, you can't. But you, you, whatever you can do but with, with your clothes. So it's, it's kind of funny things. And then I thought that, okay, I, I, can, I can do that. Okay, so I, I, and mirror, mirror, also very interesting thing for me, my object. I use a big mirror, small mirror in my work. So, so I think this, it seems like, yeah, you can see the mirror because mirror very interesting. Actually mirror, mirror um, is uh, mirror and light, the both things. Uh, we know who we are, but, uh, we supposed to doesn't know who we are. We never enlightened ourselves, our inner souls, or of supposed to you standing every day to see, see your mirror, but again, you don't know who you are. So this a light is a conjunction of light to read you every day. Light need to read yourself today, tomorrow, and thousand year back. So this is a story like a, in between light and the mirror. It's a long story and long reading and myself. So that's the things. I think I'm, I'm end up the my slide and I'm, I'm going to show some, some publication. Um, I think this is a uh, Ronaldo. Ronaldo is a writer from Italy. She, he came to my home and he did a, uh, the interview. He published a book and it was a, a fantastic book of men. Uh, the whole book was masculinity and men's. Uh, I think uh, hundred artists from all over the world. The Washko was uh, one of the artists from India, and me was a uh, and Balbir Balbir Singh was uh, another artist of the, this book. And this this is this was the the, the big opportunity because this uh, book, when they publish it's a uh, the second day they um, sells I think uh, three thousand copies. So they give the royalties also. So it's a Mando, one of the important magazine. I think, I think uh, Georgina Maddox was write me uh, four pages about me, how the Bhagirath Palace and everything was there. Uh, this, is a, this is a one another big achievement for me. 2020, they published a four pages interview. This is the latest um, come to just two days back, it was published, and they they published the second page is cover cover my work, so I was so happy, and they sent it back to me. So these are uh, my publications work and all. Now I think I, I stopped my slides, 
and I can, we can, you guys can, can ask any questions. Any questions? Prabhu, thank you so much for the uh, presentation. I had a few questions uh, after which we can look at the questions which are there. Hmm. Uh, some people have typed already. Uh, Sanjeev Sonpipre has asked a very interesting question. In fact, I would like to start with that, you know, yeah. so that we can go to my question. He says, when you say gender, are you also questioning just the idea of power or also in terms of patriarchy? So he's asking the question about, about patriarchy uh, in terms of your explanation of gender. So that will be very interesting if you address that. Yeah. Uh, I, uh, I, I can take a permission to read out that the, my, my articles. Uh, I was read the, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, I already showed that the magazines. <clears throat> so they, then it's, it's going to be very much clear uh, than what is my concept. So the figure, figure frames physical aspects relevant to the structures everybody's experience. Gender is not biological gain or vein. It's a, it's a production of dream, transformation of receiving cultures a message, cultural habit, desire machine, representing memories, action or behavior of power, a tissue attraction feelings, understanding of body, breath, permanent construction allow us to grow and up, create over self, build up own cultures. I feel the idea of love need to become compensatory and start new embarrassment, including individual state progressing with the no. No one, no only gender, but the opportunity of all colors, rainbow amalgamated with passion and pride. Bridging the idea of society, gender, masculinity, the type of create vocabulary within you which is we are all bound as well being beyond toxic norms. What is straight is, is, is often people ask, what is straight? A line can be straight or street or human heart. Oh no, carve like an alley, passage, mountain, highway or carve, which is the straight? It's a question for me. I think, um, you know, the gender is now is not one box, it's a more much, much more boxes, the pansexual, um, uh, asexual, that I told that I, I believe asexuality. So that's a uh, many more boxes. That's why the hexidixi box also run the gender in cultures and we, we also open up a uh, gender patterns. So it's a very volatile, it's, it's very open space after, uh, 377 happened and, and we can see that massive activity going on the boxes and all the time I, I think um, the box uh, is breaking and, and making a new 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 kind of boxes so it's kind of it's, it's not a, a now we, we don't follow a, a taboo or, or our beliefs but I think the um, your your belief is your main gender and your um, ego or your um, Confident. Confident is also a gender. Any question next? That's a uh, lovely uh, definition of gender, Shatati, that you read out. Very poetic and beautiful. But you haven't mentioned patriarchy. So I want you to talk a little bit about that because we, we do have to deal with a lot of patriarchal practices in our society uh, when we are negotiating those boxes, those various that whole spectrum of gender that you talked about. You know, how we negotiate that in a patriarchal society is what maybe you can share. Um, I told that uh, I don't believe the tagging or kind of uh, labeling. So that's why I told my identity is the first identity is I'm human. And uh, my ca class cast is an artist. And then then my belief, like uh, my passion belief is the asexuality. So I don't um, 
like a, I don't follow the hierarchy or lowerarchy or a kind of marginality, non-marginality. So that's that's my process. That's that's my things. Is it, no no nothing to uh, worry about that? Uh, who can um, follow you or who you can like you? So you you are the persons. The your body, your mind, your passions, your your like celebration. It's I I think ultimate. I think things. I I I don't believe the ha like uh, the patriarchy, but because uh, we 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 are like a like humans. We just uh, just uh, the, the, what is the art? The, only the happiness. Happiness is the art. When you happy, uh, your every emotion going to bound it. And and gender is also same thing. Your passions and your emotions are all things tabooed. But no labels. Please don't labels it. it there is a more boxes, many more many more drawers or rooms, but no label it. Uh, this, uh, this is an open space, I think. Uh, nowadays is an open space, uh, not East and West. It, it's very open space and people are very free and very to express their work and their things. So uh, are there any more questions from the audience that uh, you would like to the participants who have been listening so attentively and carefully. Would anybody like to type or come online and give the live questions? Prerna, what about you? Do you have any, any observations, any questions? Actually, I think Georgina, uh, you and Satatu beautifully summed it all and uh, yeah. I would uh, actually ask you, you know, as a gallerist, how did you react to Shatabdu's work? Because you told me you liked it very much. Yes, so what, uh, if you can tell me what were the things that you liked about Shatabdu's work, just to draw you out a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> Later on, you're going to hate me. <laughs> uh, I mean, Georgina, I think uh, the very first time I saw Shatabdu's work, I absolutely loved it, you know. Uh, the entire uh, thought process behind the work, uh, the aesthetics, uh, you know, uh, the use of light as a medium. Uh, I mean, everything, you know, it was it was just such a pleasure for me to view his works. So uh, Ditesh wants to say something about you. Ditesh, please tell us what you'd like to say. We are waiting. It is on your mic. Nitesh, are you there? Nitesh, are you there? Yeah. Nitesh has come. Yeah. Nitesh, we can't hear you as yet. Yeah. Hello. Hello, Nitesh. Are you there? He's connecting to the audio. I think the internet is a little slow. Okay. Uh, I, I can see the Moina Mukherjee is there. Moina Mukherjee is one of the persons I work so long. So I just requesting to Moina the, to say something about my work because he was also so long working with me, my, my work. So you can ask uh, or you can say something because you already exhibit many times with my work. Yeah, till Nitish comes on, would uh, would Maina, would you like to say something? Would yeah, like please, to... please, Maina. Can you open your video or screen? That's a permission, Mangra. Uh, I think. Preda, just give her give her the permission. Yeah. So I, I have uh, I have asked her to unmute. Ah, uh, you have to unmute. Hello. Didi, I have to unmute yourself, Didi. Nitish, now you can you can talk. 
Nitish can talk. I, I, I think there's some issue connecting with the audio, but uh, yeah, if you're not able to speak, then I would request you to type it out so that we can read out your question. Then I if think the audio is not working. He's sending me the his writing. I can ah, you can type it out. Yeah, I can, I can post it. He was uh, saying that he the last day of uh, one of the curators. Uh, says about me, he want to read that things uh, out. Okay. So I'm just going to send you that. Just give me a minute. Uh, uh, where, where I placed the chat box? Where I placed? He's saying he's unable to unmute himself. Nitish is unable to unmute. Oh, yeah. Uh, Nitish is uh, unmuted. He, I mean, he, he's not on mute, uh, not from my end. Yeah, he you can speak. To... You can speak, Nitish. I don't know where I can say it. Um, I, I think Alka um, saying something. Lena has said something. Shatadru, you have been at the forefront of several collective movements, festivals, extended events. How have you managed to keep your practice ongoing even while so many things have been going on? So she's asking about your ability to multitask. Yeah. <laughs> because um, nowadays everything is multitask. Um, and everything is mingled up uh, with um, uh, every every jobs because uh, nothing is a kind of uh, one man seat is a is kind of a togetherness. Uh, that's why we run a uh, like uh, organization. It's a togetherness, and and my work also togetherness. And you, you can see that the mediums mediums is not ultimate things. Uh, actually, the expression I told that first beginning. I don't know because I'm still searching since my language. I don't know where I'm reaching. I don't know, but my searching is a process. I, I, I don't say that uh, I, I, I am 100% satisfied with my things. Uh, this, this is a journey or it's a stepping and uh, very improvising, like all, all things are improvising and all medium is uh, for me as a challenge, challenge for me and to explore to me and I start my career as an animation designer. Then, then I understand that the animation industry every day have to upgrade yourself. So that time I was not sure with the many, many mediums. I was uh, working with a, a London-based company and I, I used to go to office and come back and I, again, I do the, my work. So then I thought that uh, how it, it's not my cup of tea to every day I have to go and, and read, read, read many, many, many more softwares. Um, every day the software is upgraded, you know, that the person going to backdate it. So that time, uh, this is a practice. And, and another thing, uh, when I go to US, this is a big eye opener for me. You know that uh, I used to sleep, uh, I think 22 hours and we, we take a pills because uh, uh, in, in a first, first day, the, our lecture finished and the two books finished. The Friday you have to, give the presentation only 15 minutes and earn your synopsis with the three books. So it's a huge study. And for me, uh, I, again, uh, my ego, because I, I was from a uh, Bengali family, my English is not up to date. So all things is a mix up. And I, again, I study and, and acknowledge, but uh, that's, that's the biggest challenge to learn and the softwares and, and my film media. So several medias. So this, this uh, kind of environment uh, I, I bring myself to fit or this kind of things. So that time I did uh, videos. Uh, I was working with a, in uh, one of the film industry. I was one month did the internship, internship and, uh, I, and I was got the job in um, Silicon Valley. I used to move, I think 2012, but we have, I mean, our family have some certain problem. So we, I am not able to go to US. But I, I'm very happy to India. I, I represent India to many more countries. I, I go to- off Hello, on. hello, I'm audible. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, 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 you are. Yeah. Please carry on. Hello, hello I'm audible. 
हेलो जोजना मैम हेलो प्रेरणा मैम हेलो सतादुर सर Uh, I saw your uh, all the paintings. It was amazing, and uh, I want to say something about uh, Satadru sir because um, we participated in a face changing competitions uh, by Kai King, and um, Kai King wrote about Satadru sir some good words. So I want to read. May I? Please. Yeah. Please go ahead. So Kai King wrote about uh, Satadru sir. He says. Uh, Satadru is a performance artist who lives in New Delhi, India. is a founder and curator of Hexi Dexi Box Art Group in India. He mainly communicates and exchange with the world through live shows on internet. This performance art group was born and developed during the epidemic. is currently a relatively work artwork performance art platform integrating performance art. group show lecture and seminar satadru himself has worked very hard at creation and has come to china many times to participate in contemporary art group exhibition and do proposal performance art in live his works emphasize visual illusion effects with the help of light and colors he creates a barrage and confused light effects the colors and colorful and overflowing and the space is filled and magical as if to evoke the narcotic illusion of art and reach this spiritual healing effect so that people can escape the trouble of the real world at a time so beautiful uh, written by kai king i just saw today morning Thank you, thank you so much, Nitish. Thank you so much for sharing that, Nitish. That was really lovely. Yeah. And yeah. Uh, it, I, I, yeah, I want to. You, you, in fact, mentioned something very interesting. The idea of the the narcotic illusion. So this is something that I, I did want to ask to you, know, Shatadru, the idea of the illusion, because even in your in your work where you talk about Facebook, uh, you talk about the illusion of Facebook where you can. you can have any identity you want and uh, you know where there's a kind of a anonymity mm. that exists uh, through the idea of this illusion mm. so i want you to talk a little bit about that yeah yeah, yeah. one of the my exhibitions uh, themes topics you are asking um, yeah uh, i think the facebook and the uh, internet jungle is a the marichika like a illusion a hallucination like you can see that the, there is a water but then we can go there is no water and many times you just uh, hide your identity hide your change your sex change your age uh, on and off and you can go to america you can you can post i mean in america the next moment you can you can write i am in london it's not possible to one minute you can travel to uh, london to america but this hallucination and the illusion create to pamper yourself to promote yourself so this is a good idea and feel happy philosophic psychologically happy yourself so this a uh, very good things uh, not bad things you are liar not liar uh, but you are happy you know, when you, when you say you are farmer maybe you do a farming every day or you are sweeper but you can say that i'm doctor i'm engineer but he feel proud so that's that's a minute we can we can give the pleasure to proud themselves so this is a challenge i think uh, things uh, i i was accept with our viewers uh, uh, viewership and is a negotiation of the space again and in is a challenge also and how you uh, stand your ideology to in front of the other people's so i i i like it and i i used to work in a first of the phases in, in 2011 i think uh, the uh, one of the solo show cyber romanticism you you publish up quite a lot of articles about me Uh, there there is a couple of work and uh, again the the same work was traveled to many country us and all and the, again the people are asking that uh, you, you the why why the uh, networking is very important to your country because you have a gossiping center because people are gossips um, i say that no there is a main imp important interest was a uh, uh, other things people don't express their psychological satisfaction to our social sociological periphery but in in the 
in the uh, social working uh, net networking uh, engine they can express their psychological frustration or psychological ego or psychological like um, authenticity so this is a fantastic things in uh, like uh, like a uh, uh all asian country or that kind of country people are very very much uh, on and off open and they they type about their uh, gender and their um, the all, all kind of discussion and discourse so i was work uh, once upon a time uh, a lot of series and lot of work uh, so and that that the uh, bulk series was i think 36 painting was sold in saffron so through saffrons also so the in, in my first solo show 2006 uh, 2007 at uh, that time i flying to us at uh, that time was also the same same subject pop culture like a pop cultures so all those things in in my work uh, slowly slowly coming and wrap up with my uh, things yeah we have one more question chatadru uh, an anonymous attendee says okay. i know chatadru and his works for over 12 years now and curated an exhibition with his works i am intrigued by the title of his work since then it would be nice if the artist can share the ideas of bringing these titles to his work i told that poetic license the first is, i i will i told that poetic license is one of important Uh, object in my work because poetic license is because i'm born born by bengali uh, in in kolkata and grew up with shanti niketan uh, the rabindranath tagore's very very and you know that uh, the all all things mount up with the uh, the poems bengali people are very much poetic very much musical very much things so first uh, when i i could not express you, you can you, you, if I, you can say that you can you can express your uh, explain your work i cannot express but i can say a, po- a line of poem so because i feel that all the painting is a poetry is not illustration because when the when the people do illustration the people uh, explain too much i think is a story telling but the painting actually is a poem is a is a melody is a noise is is come from heart i think uh, that's that's a main things okay we have one more question yeah another anonymous attendee uh i know shatadru as a multidisciplinary artist using uh, the use of blue color as a primary color of representation of his canvas since then i have just have noticed a shift in the exploration of other colors in his works and a performance in recent years could you please share the love for the blue color and also you are using other star colors now um i think the you know nothing is permanent in life nothing nothing everything is impermanent so your your love passion was going to change by time by time when you experience with your knowledge because one day uh, i i just giving a one, one example i read 23 times shesher kavita shesher kavita is a novel of rabindranath tagore in each time the meaning was changed because th- that time i have the another experience of life so again the the feelings of color are going to change every day uh, uh, the recent uh, interview of akshat sina was asking that who is your mentor or who you who you love i i just say i i say that i i can't say that's the answer because my ideas was every day change i i i can't say that jogen choudhury is my mentor because uh, when, when i was shanti niketan i i love jogen choudhury shonath kaur uh, shuas roy they are my mentors but when i go to california my mentor was some some someone else uh, i love um, namjoon park i visit his, his studio so all the time and the museum curator so every time my the idea and and my journey with with a journey energy was changed so the same thing what a blue light to green light it, it was changed uh, the color is not important now the light is more important i think how you uh, see your inner self that is main thing main main allegory i think things but it, nothing is permanent nothing is going to be stick or stagmatic 
So it, it was sifted. You can see that my painting was sifting. How, how um, like a, first the, my painting was too crowded and now that's too much empty because the pandemic going on and the, we, we feel the necessity of the space, greenery of the space and the blue sky. So you know, it, it's going to automatically change of our uh, atmosphere and all. Because we've grown up, every day we've grown up, we, uh, our baggage is so heavy. <laughs> We carry a lot of baggages, a lot of knowledges, and I, I'm very curious. And all all time, I collecting a story from the different society. I go to different country. First, I go to pubs. I want to listen to their music. What kind of listen they they listening? Interesting things. I was in uh, South Africa. I, I saw that uh, there is a gazelle, and there is a lot of our Hindustani songs because they also like the our noise because uh, the sound is is a uh, one things. Uh, which is um, like a, a universal language and the art also the universal language and it's same thing in the inner light. Light is not borrowing any country, any colors, any kind of tags. It, it's, it's universal, universal language or universal things. Yeah. And through lights, I travel miles and miles every day and, and I express and I, 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 can, I can produce more, much more things. It, it could be uh, any language, any, it could be my, my uh, written language poems, or it could be transferred with my light work or performance work or painting. But uh, the voice is same, all the time is same. It could be transferred with the expression. Uh, the, when I do a performance, when I do LED work, when I do jolly work, so all the time was uh, changing, but the, uh, the manifesto was the same. Shatadu, I'm going to now wrap up. I yeah. think the session has gone on for quite a long time. I have one last question for you. Now that you know the we have all survived, somehow managed to survive the pandemic, we are now in uh, looking at the possibility of stage three or not. I want to know what uh, is the new direction that your work is going to take uh, after if the pandemic lifts up and you get to you know leave your studio. What are your first plans? You know, uh, again, it's a history. We don't know the history and we don't know the situation. And uh, you know, the situation give the solution. I think uh, like uh, when the fire happened, you, know, you don't know where you're going, going out and who, what to do. So it's a situation I'm going to tell you. And uh, I'm very much spontaneous with my work and very much improvise my work. So according to, I, I told my studio was, uh, my, my studio was in Bhagirat Palace. So the, uh, my, my studio space is not my home. This is going to be society, is going, and, and another, another country. I go to another country, do the, some research. So it, it's very volatile. So I can't say, I, I can't I told anything, but uh, it, definitely I can include in my work and I can produce, uh, the, what inject the society of the what pain is coming to my heart and I'm going to produce that, that kind of work, that, that kind of vibration through my work. Yeah. So. Okay, thank you so much, Tadu. Thank you. Uh, Moina, this Mina is and, uh, the art house. Uh, uh -huh. Any words of... Uh, Pranomita, Pranomita can say something? Yes, yes, sure. Yeah. Uh, I just uh, enabled Pranomita. Yeah. Pratul Das. Uh, hi, Panamata. You can know. Please unmute your mic. Naveen, you want to say something? Naveen? Also, just to say that uh, the, the anonymous person was Vikash Kumar. Okay, yeah. he, he said he did not want to be anonymous. My mistake it came. Okay, okay. Thank you, because it's so lovely because uh, in the beginning of journey, because he helped me so much and Pranamita also have helped me so much. And uh, I'm so glad that because was asked, I mean, all those questions and they, they stay in my heart and all the time I'm talking to them. It's kind of reviving to my new mornings. Yeah. Thank you, because um, anyone can say something? Anybody else? So we'll just wrap it up. Yeah. Please quick. Naveen, Naveen, you can say something. Naveen? Uh, Naveen, uh, could you kindly unmute your mic? 
नवीन प्लीज मितुल Pratul Dash is asking, "Hi, what is there in your mind at the moment?" Nothing is empty. <laughs> Nothing is empty. <laughs> empty. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure to uh, like sharing my work and and those uh, things. Uh, oh, I think Mitul is saying something. Mitul, he's can... saying in terms of art practice. Oh, uh, uh, I know. I, I told you that every time we we get some kind of lesson from the society, our situation. so every time we can like we can acknowledge and we can take an acceptance to our work it could be coming because uh, art is a mirror you reflect with with your with your body with your passions uh, things so i i love to portray that my my feelings with my in the any any kind of medium uh mitul or uh, navin you want to say something अलका हरपलानी निकोलस वाज हैंड राइज इंद्रजीत वाज हैंड राइज इंद्रजीत बशा इंद्रजीत आई थिंक इंद्रजीत वाज आस्किंग हेलो या या प्लीज हेलो नॉट वोल या या ओके फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल थैंक यू एंड कंग्रेट्यूलेशन सतुदा फॉर giving the presentation uh just lovely to see all of your works i have a question to actually georgina uh uh means uh, while your presentation is going on uh, you said uh, many times that whenever you are uh, exhibiting your works out of india people are questioning about your uh, presence means about the indian thing yeah. uh, whether you are uh, this is indian art or not so i just want to know from georgina because uh, i think she is uh, uh, looking uh, your works from uh, many years uh, so what do you think of why they are questioning like this well i i, I can't really speak for them you know unfortunately i can i can uh, maybe shatadu can tell us yeah, yeah. okay so, Now my medium, my medium, my expression was so different. Like uh, you can see my jali works and then that light works. They always say that it's not Indian because uh, they know that Indian's work is so different. So always they say that oh, uh, I we don't we don't consider as Indian work. The same thing when when my work is Australia and uh, the, the the work was collected by Australian buyer. He also written a half page letter that. you are not indian you are you are like you are very much western or you, your work is because because your color is uh, like a uh, illuminating and your color have a, uh, another meaning so and so i think that that's the main thing i think i mean uh, ball games of my work and i i like that things and i i, I feel that uh, you know indian or non indian is the question because now we living in a global village is is a uh, everything open within markets and open things so all is open okay uh, and one more question actually uh, when uh, actually even i have been uh, looking at your work for many years and also i have seen your uh, present work also which you have shared with me as well uh, as you are working with light and uh, uh, the drawing means uh, i'm not talking about the uh, performance or behavioral uh, performance what you are saying i'm mostly talking about uh, your uh, presentation on the wall which you are showing with light and drawing and the present work after the uh, lockdown uh, there is the absence of light uh, okay means i don't know whether you are going to add the light uh, or not or uh, there will be uh, as raw as you have uh, shared with uh, people presently why that difference if it is uh, that raw and so without there any artificial light uh, 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 indojit thank you so much is uh, indojit was a very good artist from mumbai he is a teaching faculty of rachana college uh, right now he teaches the rachana college in mumbai 
a very good friend of mine. Uh, okay, uh, you can see that my golden and silver drawing. So golden and silver also illuminating a light, natural light. So there is a sticky, sticky light there. So uh, there, there is a light because uh, the blank space, white space, it is kind of a inviting light, the uh, whiteness. And there is a contrast of the golden and silver. It's also the light because when you do, I, I when I take the pictures, I was uh, like confused. At all time the reflection come. So that's that. Okay. Thank you. I think Nicholas uh, from Philippines. You want to ask something? Yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, good evening. Uh, hello. Good evening. Hello, Prina. Uh, hello, Georgina. I would like to congratulate you, Tado, for the nice presentations. I uh, uh, very amazing. And I have a uh, question. I I have a question about your uh, performance and the uh, artwork. How did you combine the concept? And uh, very nice. Yeah. Um, I I I count. Uh, performance art is a behavior art because it's a behavior. So when I do painting, also it's a behavior. Like yes. I, I, I scribbled, uh, I'm expressing. And when you do a digital work, also is a, a behavior art, scribbled, and I manifested it. They, 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 they all improvise and all the same process. And it's, yeah. a, it's a category that you can tag the painting, the LED work, or things. That's why I don't I don't write the, my paintings. I write uh, freedom of uh, uh, freedom of speech. Freedom of speech. It's, uh, freedom. Uh, there, there, you can say everything. So that's everything is actually uh, yourself, your identity. You can do uh, the pen or the brass or the mouse or the, uh, the light. Everything is the same because you are yeah. persons. You are liking, disliking is the same person. Okay, thank you, Sutadro, and congratulations. Uh -huh. Okay. So, Pranomita, you, you want to say something? Pranomita? Pranomita? Pranomita, you want to say something? I think no one. Any questions? Anybody? Pradeep Shandipta? I think uh, Pratul had something to yeah, say. Yeah. Please, please, please. On. Uh, Pratul, could you kindly unmute your mic? Yeah. Hey, hi, Satatro, and hi, Prerna. Hi, Georgi. How are you? Hope the trust everybody is fine. Uh, yeah. So, as you know, Satatu, I, I many said I've said that many times. I've said that I like your works, and there is I don't want to repeat it again. Uh, but when I asked, you know, like what's going on at the moment in the in the context of art practice? So my question, as you said, that we many a time we talk about the behaviors, performances, and all that. So that in the in the context of that performances and uh, mind, you know, like how, because mind is, as you know, that, I mean, I don't have to explain that how mind is function. So as a creative person, as a reactive, reactionary person, how to react to the, con in today's context, basically, that's what my question was. Yeah, I already show that uh, today's reaction in my work, because uh, now uh, we, we like the, enjoying the blue sky. In no, I, I, I just wanted to hear from you. You know, I have seen that what you said and all what you said, but I just want uh, a very present moment I'm talking, basically. Moment I'm sitting and enjoying. <laughs> no, that is there, but what's going on in your mind? Because see, uh, as you said that you, when you read different books, different uh, literatures, and there's a certain kind of effect in your body and mind. You know, now, now with... Right now, no poem coming to my mouth. <laughs> no, uh, oh, so, sorry, sorry, there was a call. So, in between. Okay. so uh, yeah, so what, uh, what is there? How, is that all those things are disturbing you? Or how, how do you look at, I mean, how you are reacting to those situations, basically? Yeah. Uh, I... There's nothing political about it. My question is nothing to do with politics. Yeah, uh, I feel, I told that uh, it's a history and I take a challenge 
and I, I embarrassing uh, and embarrass of the situation and I enjoy the same time I enjoy the moment when we lock down yourself in a room and you, you're doing uh, some other other things. You're not usual, as usual, but you are doing something else. It, it's a, it's given a, another opportunity to you think about yourself. I think uh, I'm doing that. It's a big time to research your things, research your genres, read a book or some big, different things. Now the people say that be slow. Now the before the, everybody said, hurry up, you can run, run, run. So it, it's a time for stop yourself. And it's kind of full stop, but not full stop. There's a, there's a kind of uh, Jones, you're standing surrounding yourself. So that's the same thing. And the paranoid space, uh, paranoid things I was expressing with my paint, uh, performance art, and I am using under some kind of incrimination with my painting also. My painting also shifted to one genre to another genre. Maybe the, the third uh, slip, uh, the waves come, then uh, my painting uh, again going to change uh, another, another direction. Things. That's great. Thank you. Welcome. Uh, so I, I think, uh, you know, this would be a good time to uh, for us to uh, wrap the webinar up. Uh, is that okay, Georgina and Sadatu? Yeah, yeah. Thank you to invite me and, and host me. And I'm, I'm so glad that uh, your gallery was uh, like uh, giving the chances to showcase my work. It's a, it's a very, very big opportunity. And I was associated with Georgina so long, I think 2009 or 10. So, and we are working together in many shows and uh, she also write um, articles about me. And I'm uh, very glad to associate with now, Perna. And I'm, I'm thankful to again, uh, the Pronomita and Vikas uh, to help you to introduce yourself. So uh, uh, that's all. and. Uh, uh, I'm glad to express my ideas and jot down of thinking. And still, I'm searching. I, I told that to everybody, I'm still searching my way and journey. I'm not sure that where my expression is going to be uh, forecasted. It's, it's going to be poetic, it's going to be light, it's going to be performance, it's going to be painting. Still, I'm searching uh, my, my ideas and, and kind of a shape. Uh, my shape was very, very uneven. And you can see that my my the painting uh, not, not <coughs> square <coughs> not square yeah, yeah. <coughs> uneven shape. That's also a, a cause of the gender because uh, when I go to the U.S., I see that the uh, gender uh, the sexuality is given on the bed of the square. But I I can see that uh, like in, in my country you can see the narrow lens. People are hugging each other, or in a in the ground or in the seaside, in the riverside, people are, people are uh, 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 kissing each other. So this uh, make me more conscious to this point. So our, our, our concept is not square or kind of um, regular, it's very irregular. So my, all the shapes now, now like, uh, like uh, I think uh, 10 years, I, I break the square shape and I'm doing the uneven shape for all, all the work. So that's the cause I'm, I'm doing that. I don't know when the, any other experience comes up, so then I can change uh, any more things. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you, Sitaji. Uh, Georgina, you'll have to unmute yourself. Hmm. So I was just saying thank you, Shatadu, thank you, Prerna, and everybody else who uh, has been behind the scenes for putting this together. It was a very lovely presentation. I think we got to see a lot of uh, new and different work from Shatadu and also discuss many aspects of uh, gender, sexuality, light, and the, and the pandemic. So uh, hopefully this will leave us with lots of thoughts that we can then, uh, you know, uh, crystallize and share in the form of newer works, newer approaches, newer shows that we can curate so looking forward to working with both of you and uh, all the best. Thank you. Thank you all, all the participants uh, far away from other, other country. So I'm, I'm so glad that uh, please give the loves and hugs 
to me and i can i can this is the my power i can i can energetic with that power i can i can produce more and more kind of work thank you so much to everyone thank you so much georgina uh, and satadru for your lovely words and uh, uh, thank you georgina for sharing your observations and satadru for uh, sharing uh, your works and uh, you know your process behind the scene um on behalf of afri art house i would like to thank everyone for joining us and uh, you know for staying uh, staying with us till the end of the webinar uh, i thoroughly enjoyed this conversation uh so so thank you everyone and uh, have a great evening ahead uh, i'll be ending this webinar now and uh, you can feel free to share your feedback through the form attached at the end thank you so much thank you bye 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 good evening everybody bye